to run away to the stables when you thought you were in imminent danger of a spanking. You never spanked me. Of course not, but you weren't supposed to know that. Oh. Do you know, my darling, beautiful daughter, that everybody's concerned about your mysterious disappearance this morning? Well, it's good for him. A little mystery should always surround a wedding. Mm. Well, it's too bad you're uh, too big to spank. Too big, much too big. Yeah, but you're not too big to talk, and that's what I want to do, so come sit down with me. I don't think I want to have much chance to talk to you before I walk you down the aisle. There's a couple of things I want to get off my chest. First, let's see. I I feel a great sense of well-being when I think of you and Cruz. I want you to know that. And I can't wait to watch you thrive in your marriage and family. You're going to have a family. You're going to be wonderful parents. And you won't make the same mistakes your parents made. I don't remember any mistakes. That's because you got a good heart, Di. <laughs> oh, I wish I could have done much better uh, than I did. Uh, but as flawed as I was, darling, and uh, am today, I don't think you ever doubted how much I love you. Look what I'm trying to say. I, I, I'm taking a long way around to say it, is that whatever happens to the family, and whatever all the changes that come about, the one thing that is a constant is how much I love you. And whatever happens between your mother and me, I'll always be there for you, baby. I promise you that. I know, Daddy. I just want you to be happy. You and Mama? All right, now wait a minute. <laughs> just, just listen to me a minute. Today, you do not spend one second worrying about me and Mama or anybody else. This is your day. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. That girl. I love you so much. I love you, too. It's just that, uh... <laughs> You're not going to be my little girl after today. 